in the aftermath of some of these tornadoes and storms. Let's bring in Cal. Cal, give me a, a, your location. What you're seeing right now, it looks like you're finding more damage, unfortunately, in the Claremore area. Yeah, Alan, east of Claremore along Highway 20 at the Will Rogers Downs Casino and the horse racing area. We talked with people who have been coming in and out. One man telling us he's got horses that are kept here on the property. He describes this scene as an absolute war zone. Those are his words saying horses are running free because of knockdown fences and caging. Says that uh, campers are turned over and that's what we found here so far early this morning. You can see one of those campers turned over completely and then sandwiched onto uh, on top of a car here. This is at the KOA campsite, which is right near the casino. And that kind of gives you an indication of how strong these winds were. We talked with a woman who says that the storm just blew through so quick, they almost had no time to take shelter and they had to uh, they had to take shelter in their camper, which of course, not ideal given these circumstances, but just a really uh, fortunate to make it out of that situation. And we're seeing just all kinds of damage scattered all throughout this area. Of course, the Sinclair gas station across the street, that is a command center for first responders as they work not only at the campground, but also in the neighborhoods nearby where there's a lot of down power lines, down trees and damage to homes. And we're also told by an officer over at that command center that there were several people trapped at some point here at the KOA campground. But those people are, to his understanding, mostly okay and have gone to the hospital to get uh, treatment at this time. We talked with a man who said he had a family member in here, and his family member had a broken arm just from being trapped in here. But a lot of the people we talked to say just a very quick but a very scary situation out here. We're seeing widespread damage throughout Claremore and then down Highway 20 as we go towards Pryor. Lots of down power lines down and 